Hello, YouTube trolls, normal people, demons and angels from around the globe. Vikanug here, bringing you Attack the Block Review, Attack the Review Review. Try saying that ten times when you're drunk. Anyway, I found this review of Attack the Block Online, and there's a few little things I'm not too quite sure you got about the movie. Um, I think it was a very good movie, but let's have a look at their review. Hey everybody, it's Xena! Hi Xena! In today's review, I'm going to be doing it on Attack the Block. Attack the Block. I wanted to see this movie for a while and I was finally able to see it like I think about a week ago. Yippee! Yippee! But pretty much the movie uh, is about these teenagers. Even though I've heard people say, even in the description of the movie, they're calling these teenagers thugs. I personally don't really think that they're thugs. Well, maybe because they are fucking thugs. They're teenager thugs. Just because they're a teenager doesn't mean that they're not a thug. Duh. I mean, does this look like your average everyday teenager? No! I'll prove it. With my board, I'm gonna draw exactly what a thug is, okay? Oh, really? Okay. So, usually thugs. First of all, they have these funny looking faces on, like they're about to just do something, like they're about to attack you at any moment, right? Oh, you mean like this? <laughs> I'm gonna attack you at any moment now! <laughs> oh. Then, they also have these, like, like a look in their eye, but you can't really tell about the look. Simply for the fact that they're wearing an eye patch. You mean like a fucking pirate? Oh, me hearty yahoo! I'm gonna attack you at any moment because you've got me treasure. Because a thug, like the definition of a thug, to me, is a guy or a woman who was either stabbed or shot while playing Nintendo. Stabbed. Or shot while playing Nintendo. While well, I'm in my house. It's not Nintendo, but I think it counts. <laughs> hey, motherfucker. <laughs> Damn it! I am now a thug because I was shot while playing the Xbox. And they have long hair and you know that they don't care. Oh, you mean kind of like the thugs that have no hair at all in the movie? Just putting it out there. Cuckoo! Cuckoo! <laughs> cuckoo! Cuckoo! Okay, this looks just like the thug. Doesn't this look like a thug? Oh yeah, sure, that looks like a thug. <laughs> fucking insane! Fuck! <laughs> yeah, let the let these people, you know. They're not thugs, you know, let them just go about their everyday life. But this person here, you better watch out for him. He's a thug. A happy thug! Yippee! I think, I think last night I went to Walmart and there was a thug in the line. Oh yeah, same thing happened to me when I went to Morrison's, and everyone was a thug. Fuck me, I got out of there quick as soon as I got my can of Red Bull. 
Okay, so the movie's pretty much about these teenagers. Like I said, I'm not gonna call them thugs. Oh no, don't call these guys over here. Thugs. They're happy little teenagers. Yippee! Something comes crashing down from the sky and it's pretty much an alien. Something comes flying down from the sky. It's pretty much an alien. Of course it is. Oh, what's that? You know what? I think it's pretty much an alien. Of course it is. Yeah, yeah, it's an alien. Of course it is. No, no, no leave him alone. It's pretty much an alien. Of course it is. Fuck him. The alien tries to attack the head, like the leader of all the friends. Oh my god! A thug! Stay away from me. Stay away from me. I've got a spoon, brother. And I'm not afraid to use it. You heard that the aliens look really unique. I'll give her that one. The aliens do look unique. I mean, a glowing mouth and they're all furry, jet black. They are unique. But it's not as unique as that mugger over there. Yippee! Pretty much, I thought that the movie was very unique. Um, I've never seen a movie like that before. Well, yeah, I guess it is a pretty unique movie. Um, not your typical alien or whatever like that. I mean, these things are fucking ferocious. I mean... Oh no! A thug! Yippee! The cast was very awesome. Um, everybody did a great job. And there's likable characters. Granted, the cast was very good, apart from... Well, in the trailer, we're like, huh? Nick Frost! Maybe no Simon Pegg, but we've got Nick Frost in another movie! Yes! Oh. He was in the whole thing for about 30 fucking seconds! I mean, because at first, I didn't really like the characters because they was robbing a lady, you know? Like, what is that? And at the same time, I'm thinking to myself, how can anyone even take them seriously when they're robbing this lady? Because they didn't really look like thugs. Like, if that's the case, I feel like I could rob someone. I could rob someone while wearing my cat ears. Oh no, they didn't look like thugs. Are we on this fucking thing again? They're wearing balaclavas. They're got hoodies on, you know, they've got a fucking knife. And you want to rob this poor young lady in a fucking suit with meow cat ears. Then again, Michelle Pfeiffer. I am Meow, Catwoman, we meet again. Oh no, a fork! Whoa! I've got a spoon. Take that. Overall, I do recommend this movie. Okay, so we've seen that part of the review now. Ah, man, I'll take whatever she is having. Happy, yeah. Ah, uh, drugs. Ah, uh, the review. Uh, aliens are pretty. I mean, if I had to nitpick, um, the only few things I have to nitpick about are, okay, spoiler alert. is when they've got all the aliens in the room at the end, they blow the whole fucking thing to sky high smithereens and we're like, a oh, main character, he's surely dead. I mean, he was in there with all the aliens and that big bada boom explosion happened. Where the fuck is he? And then, oh, wouldn't you know it, he's just hanging from a flag off the balcony. Kinda like, when, you know, Indiana Jones is on that tank and he's flying off the fucking cliff and you're like, oh fuck, Indiana Jones, no! 
Indy! And he's just hanging on a branch. Yippee. Okay, and one more thing if I want to be nitpicky about the movie is, like, this whole thing of Chav culture. Understandable, but... Okay, I guess I am lucky and everyone else in England and London is lucky to understand what the fuck these people are saying. But when they're saying things like... What is that, cuz? That's an alien, bruv. Believe it. And... Yo, check it. More. More what? Them things. Then it's kind of hard to understand what the fuck they're saying. You get me, blood. True that. Oh. Don't forget them things on my pizza, you get me. Oh, and speaking of pizza, how much of a fucking advertisement is this? Pizza Go Go, where chavs deliver your pizza. If you fucking get it. So, other than that, that's my movie review, Attack of the Review, review, over. Nothing else to say. Other than that, it's a pretty good fucking movie. I recommend seeing it, just a little things that I had to nitpick about in the movie, and them 150,002 billion, zillion, willion, squillion, billion, tillion things I had to mention in the review of the review. Other than that, it's an epic movie. I give it 8 out of 10 aliens.